Hi everyone, this is Indrajit and you are watching Iconic Indro. Nowadays, there is a problem arising among the students. That is, how to answer 1 mark, 2 marks, 3 marks and 4 or 5 marks question. Because they are very confused while answering this type of question. So I am here to answer you to how to answer such type of questions. So, get start. By the way, before starting this video, please subscribe my YouTube channel Iconic Indro because in this channel you will get a lot of English related video as well as study tips. So, stay tuned with us. First of all, in one mark question, you have to write one line or 8 to 10 words. That is the complete and impactful answer. Suppose you have to write the definition or those question says that what is something then you have to write the definition to give your answer impactful. The, the definition within one line or you have to write 8 to 10 words to define this something. Okay, keep in that mind that you have to write 8 to 10 words or one line in one mark question. Now in two marks question you have to write two lines or 15 to 20 words because it is enough to write this type of answer and it will be complete as well as impactful. So you have to write 15 to 20 words as well as two lines. Suppose who gave it to whom? Then you have to write the name of the who and the name of the whom. Okay. This is gonna be impactful answer in your exam sheet. In 3 marks question, you have to write an informative as well as impactful answer within 6 lines or you have to write the answer within 50 to 60 words because it is enough to write such type of answer. For example, suppose in the question it says that what is the application of something? Then you have to write the application of something within 6 lines. That means here you have to write 3 points. First point, then you have to write 2 lines for that first point. Then second point, you have to write 2 lines for the second point. And third point, you have to write 2 lines for the third points. On the other hand, the question says that what is the difference between this and that or what is the difference between something or another something then you have to write the six points to differentiate both of them clear got it remember in your mind that while differentiating the in the three marks question you have to write at least six points at least six points to give your answer impactful as well as perfect and next query is how to write or how to answer the 4 marks or 5 marks question listen it is lengthy or big question so you have to describe as well as explain your answer and provide some informations to give your answer impact so keep in your mind that you have to write at least 100 words or 10 lines 10 to 12 lines that is enough for writing the lengthy question for example suppose write a short note about something okay so you have to write the introduction lines that would be within one line then you have to write the definition of that topic of that particular topic and then you have to write the application of the topic that is gonna be point based okay you have to write at least three to four points or five points in that application para then you have to write the conclusion so in conclusion you have to write at least two lines to give your impact in your answer so follow this rule and get the full marks in your exam. Happy learning.
Thus, whatever I am saying to you, if you follow this in your examination, you will get the full marks of the exam paper and your answer will be impactful as well as perfect to the teachers. If this video helps you to improve your writing skill as well as you to improve your score in the examination, please give a like, share to your friends and if you are new in this channel, please subscribe my YouTube channel Iconic Indro because you will be updated for more study tips as well as English related videos. So keep watching Iconic Indro and subscribe this channel. Thank you. See you soon in my next video. Bye.